भीमातीर निवासाय पंडरीपुरवासिने पांडुरंग प्रकाशाय विठलाय नमो नम मरुत्पुत्राय कवयी भीमाय भयहारिणे श्रीमदानंदतीर्थाय प्रख्याताय नमो नम डिअर चिल्ड्रन ऑफ गॉड जय श्री कृष्ण नमस्ते सम वन विस्पर द स्टोरी इन टू माय इयर आय नरेटेड टू यू दे लिव द पुअर ब्राह्मण इन अ स्मॉल टाउन ही वॉज पायस गॉड फियरिंग काइंड एंड प्योर एट हार्ट ही मेड इज लिविंग बाय अप्रोचिंग द एफ्लुएंट फॉर हेल्प ही न्यू फ्यू रिच हाउसेज इन द नेबरहुड वन बाय वन ही वुड अप्रोच दैम वेन नीड रिक्वायर्ड हेम टू डू सो दिस डे विच वी रिकॉर्ड फॉर यू इज अ सिग्निफिकेंट डे इन इज लाइफ विथ ग्रेट कॉन्फिडेंस ही अप्रोच अ मिलियनर हु हैड हेल्प हिम अर्लियर एज ही स्टूड एट द गेट ऑफ द पेलेशियल मैंशन The gates were locked. The gatekeeper refused to let him in. He walked around the large compound wall, looking at the balcony, the open windows, trying to see the familiar face of his benefactor, to receive more help. But when he saw a glimpse of his face, as soon as the other person eyed him, the window was shut and shut forever. Oh the poor brahmin cried the whole night because his hopes had crashed i call this the lost appeal the following morrow our poor brahmin hungry and sad put on his simple garment and walked farther away to a distant area where rich men had built their villas he stood at the door and waited for long waiting waiting he found that an unwilling guard let him in he waited in the veranda for quite some time waiting for the rich master of the house to arrive the chair which our man occupied was not very comfortable sometimes he stood up sometimes he sat down sometimes he thought he heard a step but when no one turned up he sat down without hope he wiped his sweating hands with his upper cloth and felt nervous after a long wait the rich man arrived He was very kind and courteous in his words, but finally said, "Sir, I know you are in trouble, uh, but I have helped you many times. I know your need, but you understand my position too. I will try to do my best for you. Uh, now you may go." With a namaste on both sides, the poor Brahmin departed. He came out of the house, and the world for him was dark, dark, and dark. He had no hope, no silver lining, nowhere to go. He said to himself. This is the last appeal. As he stood literally at the crossroads, a group of devotees came singing bhajans on the way to the famous Krishna temple nearby. Involuntarily he joined them. He knew Shri Krishna was calling. There was no choice. He danced and sang Ram Krishna Hari Mukund Murari Ram Krishna Hari मुकुंद मुरारी पांडुरंग 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 हरी राम कृष्ण हरी राम कृष्ण हरी राम कृष्ण हरी ही सांग द भजन ऑल द वे एन रीच द टेम्पल वेन यू क्लाइम द स्टेप्स ऑफ द टेम्पल द क्राउड ऑफ डेवोटीज एट दिस एपियर He alone walked up towards the shrine and looked at the Lord's figure in front of him with eyes full of tears. He spread his upper cloth on the ground in sheer despair. In one minute, he was forced to open his eyes. An invisible hand had placed a huge bag there. When he opened it, it was sparkling with diamonds, golden coins, currency, and so on, which would last him for generations. He looked at the Lord and thanked him and said. This is the lasting appeal, Master. The lasting appeal. The message for today is: the lost appeal, the last appeal, and the lasting, lasting appeal. कोई कहे शाम और कोई कहे मीरा वो ही पाए सोना वो ही पाए हीरा कोई कहे शाम और कोई कहे मीरा वही पाई सोना वही पाई हीरा